A good way of gauging the heat of polytonal music is by taking a look at the circle of fifths. If the key centers are close to one another, it won't be that spicy. So for example, if I sing happy birthday in the key of G while accompanying myself in the key of C, it will be fairly mild. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Dan Aykroyd, who was born this day on July 1st in 1952. Happy birthday to you. It might sound a little strange, a little off, but we can ratchet up the spice level by moving around the circle of fifths to say the key of E. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Missy Elliott, who was also born on July 1st. Happy birthday to you. Whew, muy picante. What if we ratchet up the spice level even more to the key of F sharp? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Liv Tyler, also a July 1st baby. Happy birthday to you. You. By this point, the spice level might not be tolerable for most people in this musical dish that we've been cooking up. The dish has been ruined by too much spice. Context, of course, matters here. You wouldn't normally sing happy birthday to you as a polytonal piece of music. But of course, that invariably almost always happens. Happy birthday.